everybody, uh, this is Taylor Moss from Everything at SN. Today I'm going to show you guys how to import pictures uh, from a digital camera or Android device. So when you first plug in your SD card or your camera or plug in your Android via USB, you'll get this autoplay box that comes up. And there's a lot of different options and um, a lot of people get confused as to what to do. Um, most of the time you just click on this open and view file folders. If you click that, it'll pull up um, the actual data that's inside of that card or that camera or this Android device. And um, you'll always want to look for a folder called DCIM. It's where all the images are stored. So if you double click on that, there will be a few more folders. Uh, one of which being 100 media. Sometimes it's called like one, 101 media or like if you have a Canon camera, it'd be called 100 Canon or something similar to that. So if you double click on that, it'll bring up all your photos. Um, from here, you can simply scroll through, find the ones you like. Once you have them, you can just click, press Control, click a few more, or hold Shift and select multiples. From here, you can drag them straight to your desktop, or if you'd like them to be somewhere else, uh, say in your Pictures folder, you can open up your Pictures folder and drag them right into there. It'll copy them for you, and it won't erase them. Uh, that's another one of the problems with those autoplay features at the beginning that you saw. Uh, I'll pull that right back up for you. So as you can see here, um, if you do this import pictures with videos or import pictures with Windows Live Photo Gallery, it can sometimes remove those images that you're importing so you actually don't have them on the camera or the Android anymore. Hope you guys learned something. Thanks for watching.